how to make a website on Big Cartel. Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we use Big Cartel to create our own online store, how can we create a website for our dropshipping business. So here we are on our bigcartel.com website, I've already logged in. So if you are interested in creating a website, I think that you know how does Big Cartel work. If you want to find some additional tutorials, you can find them on our channel or through search of course and here we are on our account page and if you already added products in your products folder uh, you can now start to create your um, website with your uh, like design you can customize every single step and in order to do it right we need to open our account in the right top corner and then just simply scroll down to find your shop area and as you can see i already have a shop if you don't have you can just simply click on create a shop or something like this and in order to create a design created like more personalized we just simply need to click on design in the right bottom corner of this uh, page and we'll come to our editor from this page here we can easily view how does it look like um, like how does our website look like and in the left side we have a couple of options we can manage in order to interact with our website what is interesting is that in the right top corner we can also switch between different devices from tablet to desktop and to phone because you know every single device has its own parameters and we need to optimize it for our for every single device basically but a big cartel also provides us the opportunity to use uh, responsive themes so they're like um, responsive for every single device and let's let me show you how can we interact with the theme so in the top of the screen in the left side menu we have this option themes and um, Big Cartel provides us the opportunity to use their own designs to pro like to promote our um, shipping stuff, to promote our products. And if we we'll scroll down, we can find that there are a lot of different templates uh, we can use, and we can use them totally for free. Maybe some of them are even like we need to pay for them, but at least these are free. So you can try to find something suitable as for you, and we can try to. Uh, use this theme to see how will it look like maybe this one or this one so sometimes it's much easier to find something suitable as for us and to not stay and do not even like try to create because uh, big cartel is like constructor they helps us to make it easy to make it like uh, in a few clicks and I think that it's more useful to find some related designs. As for me, I found this one as and uh, for as for my shop, it's more suitable. Nothing hard. Inf interface is pretty easy to understand. It's pretty easy to use. We can open every single page for the product, and we can click on price, for example, add it to cart, and the interface is quite quite easy. So. Um, if you want to add some additional stuff, you need to use a code like integration. So as you can see, um, it's not like available for free plan. On the free plan, you can only use uh, default themes. You can customize them through colors, fonts, and so on. But if you want to add some additional stuff, you need to use uh, like upgraded version. So we can add a CSS code, HTML code, and after that, uh, some stuff on our website will be automatically upgraded and some features may uh, work a little bit like in a different way and also we can uh, manage our pages uh, from the constructor here so we will open our pages stuff we just simply need to find the necessary one so we have like about page for example where we can add some additional information we can also uh, add a new page for example click on add a new add a name and add what's inside i don't think that it's really useful because all the themes and all the schemas of uh, different websites are pretty like easy to understand and it's pretty easy to interact with and all you need to do through your website is to make people to buy because if you promote it in the other medias for example in instagram youtube and somewhere else uh, people just simply need to order your thing through your website so yeah 
Uh, I think that the most uh, important uh, folder here is our settings page where we can add our logo here. So if your um, shop is branded, you can just simply add your logo right up here. You can add a background image if you don't want it to be like a white colored uh, like stuff. And also what is interesting is that we can manage our uh, we can manage our colors. For example, if you want to change a button's background, we just simply need to find this parameter, button background. And after that, let's make, let's see that we want to make it like green, for example. Let's try to change. And if we'll come to someone's page, we can find that now this button is like uh, in color, in, in a green color. But if we'll hover, it will change to blue. So let's change button background hover, for example, to maybe yellow, something like this. And now, and now it works like this. Pretty cool, pretty interesting, pretty easy to understand. We can also change a fonts, like header font. So let's edit, make it like this, for example. And also let's try to change a font, just simple font in this stuff here. As you can see, nothing hard. Everything is pretty easy. We can also add some options like display and announce message and so on. Product, grid, image size and some other stuff. When everything is done, we just simply need to click on publish and yeah, that's all. Our website was automatically published to uh, like um, web. Now I can click on exit. And if I click on this link here uh, to open my store, it will be automatically opened. As you can see, all the changes were added, but basically sometimes you need to wait. Uh, I've closed uh, the I've closed the folder until it was uh, like uploaded with the new stuff. And as you can see, this button is like red instead of green. Uh, so yeah, sometimes it could be really helpful to wait for a little. And now our uh, website is ready to be launched. So you can share this link with your customers and they can easily buy something if it's necessary as for them. And yeah. Uh, if we'll try to add some products, uh, we can see that on the pre-plan you can add up to five products for free. If you want to add more, you can easily upgrade your website version to the paid plan. They have like nine dollars. Uh, they have like nine dollars. A plan like ten dollars and like up to five hundred products, like twenty dollars per month. We can easily find all the differences. So of course, if you'd like to start, a free plan is really suitable. But uh, to continue, what to make it easier? Of course, um, the paid plans are pretty pretty cool, and it depends on your number of products inside of your store. What plan would you like to use? So yeah, hope this video helped you out. If it is, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel and write your honest comment. So yeah, I wish you a very good day. Goodbye.